Hello guys, this is the next Unity tutorial about UFPS, the NAV Mesh and Hit Animations. Let's have a look at the current development state when I hit this zombie here. And each time I hit him, you can see that he is moving on, okay? He is moving towards us. But in reality, when a guy is hit by a bullet, he's at least stopping for a moment. So let's see how to implement this logic. Let's open the animator controller and have a look at the hit animation state. Here is the animation and what we need is an event so that we are notified in our script when the animation is finished. We know when it is started. This is when the bullet hits the enemy and then we will disable the nav mesh and in the we call this on hit and event we will enable it again and this will be more realistic okay so apply this now we have an event on hit end and we will open up the damage handler enemy and implement this method Okay, let's find the damage method and this is where the enemy is hit by the bullet and here we get the NAV mesh agent and disable it so that the character isn't moving when he is hit by the bullet. Just set enabled to false. Okay, and now we use this event, this method on hit end, and this is called before this animation, the hit animation is finished, and here we enable the nav mesh agent again. Okay, I think that's all, let's just test it, but before that I will increase the acceleration of the enemy and also the speed. And now let's see. I think that's a cool logic. That's the AI. Yeah, you see how he's stopping when, when I hit him. Bam, bam, and he's stopping and then he's moving on. Yeah, that is realistic, at least for a zombie guy that takes 15 bullets before he dies. Well guys, that's it. I really hope you liked this video and if you do, please let me know and subscribe to this channel. And it would be so amazing if you could support me on my Patreon. Well, perhaps sometime I could work less on my regular job or go full time for creating those videos. Thanks a lot my friends for watching and come back soon to JNM.